I'm going to show you how to make high resolution 4K snapshots using PowerDirector. Let's get sharp and crispy. I have a 4K video clip in the media library, so I'm going to right click on this. I'm going to go to properties. And you'll see that the resolution is 3840 by 2160, which is 4K ultra high definition. I'll go ahead and close this out. Now, in order to get a 4K snapshot, one way that you can do it is by changing your preview quality in the preferences. So if you go to preferences and you go to display, you can change it to Ultra HD preview resolution. So once you have your timeline set up at that preview quality, you go ahead and click on OK. Now you can go ahead and bring your clip to the timeline and you can move your playhead to wherever you need it to be to go ahead and get your screen capture. And then you can go ahead and click on the snapshot button or you could do control P on your keyboard. You go ahead and select the location where you want to save the snapshot and you can give it a name if you want to. And then you can go ahead and click on save. Now, if we right click on the snapshot that was just created and we go to properties, you see that the resolution for this image is 3840 by 2160. So now we have a 4k ultra high definition picture. I'm going to go ahead and close this out. Now, unfortunately, even if you switch your preview quality to ultra HD, sometimes the image isn't 4k. I'm going to show you how to get a 4k image every time without fail. So let's go ahead and click on this clip that's in the timeline. I'll go ahead and hit delete on my keyboard to get rid of it. Now I'm going to go back to the video clip and I'm going to left click on it while it's here in the media library. And this time I'm going to use my preview and select the frame that I want to take. So I'll go to the same position. I'll hit enter. And now I'm going to go ahead and do control P from the preview window. And it'll create a new snapshot. And we'll just give it a different name and we'll go ahead and hit save. Now you see we have a new snapshot here. I'll right click on it. I'll go to properties. And you'll see that the resolution is 3840 by 2160. Now you got some high resolution loving. If you want to use snapshots to make a photo freeze frame, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to smash my cartoon face to subscribe. Hit me up with your comments and drop me a like down below.